Okay, so as we differentiate this, this is the product rule. There's two functions. So u mm. equals x. Um, we'll make we'll do u dash. So if u equals x, u dash is what's u dash? One. Is it it's x squared? Well, it's the derivative of x. So what's the derivative of x? You've got the x squared in that One. question. There's no x squared in that question. The question there is. Is there? Yeah. You wrote up x. No, it's a equals x the square times the square root. Yeah, no, but in, in the second, in the square root, in the square root, that's x squared. Okay, so that's u dash. V dash is going to be the square root of 3600 minus x squared. I like everything in index form, so I'm going to convert it into index form. Um, so to the power of a half? Yeah. Alright, so now what we're going to do is we're going to derive it. So v dash is going to be a half times, what's the derivative of? Negative 2x. Yep, times negative 2x times the original brackets, except now it's to the power of negative, negative half. half. So we'll fix this up. So a half times negative 2x is negative x. Um, brackets 3600 minus x squared to the, to the negative a half. So I'm going to I'll leave it as is now. So we do the product rule. So we do a dash. So a dash is the same as a dash equals u dash v plus v dash u. So we're just going to cross multiply. So that's 1 times the square root of 3,600 minus x squared. Um, and it's v dash times u, so it's going to be plus x times negative x, brackets 3,600, x to the power of 2 to the negative a half. So we'll just clean that up. I'll start to put the um, the radical symbols in or the square um, right. and the third symbols. You don't want to. And well, you should it might because. Be easier. Huh? Well, you factorise it out, don't you? So it might be easier to keep it. Yeah, you'd have to find the yeah. stuff. Yeah. Well, there's two ways of doing it. You can make take the radical. Well, you can actually make it the radical symbols and then solve the equation or you can factorise. Yeah, factorising is good. I encourage you to factorise, so you should do that. Uh, that was mine. No, no, that's good. That's good. You didn't point it out, you never know. Alright, so what's the what's the common factor between these two? 3,600 minus x squared to the power of math minus a half. Yeah, so 3,600 minus x squared to the power of what? Negative a half? Just half. Negative half. Negative half. So how do I well how do I convert that into this set of brackets? How am I going to change this into this? Times the power of three is the So just times it by power of one? Yeah. And since that's that section there, we leave it and we only have to multiply this part here. That's plus negative x squared. So now we have a dash equals to 3600 minus x squared to the power of negative a half. Brackets 3600 uh, minus x squared minus x squared. Well, basically to the power of one means it's the same thing, yep. it's as is. So